done. This one is is mine. Investigate it. Investigate it. All right, let's go inspect what's up here. Nothing important, I guess. Beer can. So there are beer cans all over the ground up here leading up the hill. That's annoying. Yeah, thing is, there were a bunch down at that campsite yesterday. Coincidence, maybe? I don't think so. Same brand, everything. These fucking kids. Why do you think they'd be up here? Hell if I know, but they better have stayed away from our communication stuff. C clean up, clean up. More beers. Well, I hopped down a drop and now I can't climb back up. Mm, that is a pickle. I can just keep hiking, but I figured I should let you know in case I get myself trapped out here. Hmm, how adventurous of you. I've been doing a lot more climbing out here than I expected. Well, keep your radio charged. I'd hate to one day find a skeleton with an orange backpack at the bottom of a ravine. More? More beer packs? Wow. Hmm. Uh, yeah, okay, the wire's down here. Okay, good. Any sign of those girls? Did they mess with anything? I'll look around. What? Go to hell. So the wire is definitely down out here. I just found it. Yeah, the thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was cut deliberately. I knew it. The moment you said you found their trash. <sighs> These idiots are going to pay. Do they realize this is how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? And God forbid there's an actual fire burning out of control. What do you want to do? I want you to go find them. And then what? I... I haven't thought that far ahead. That's not true. Everything that comes to mind is illegal. Hmm. Let's hear it. Oh, yeah? Hey, I came out here for a breath of fresh air and some adventure. What do you got? I think I want you to just find them and scare the hell out of them. Yeah, I'd make a spooky ghost costume, but they stole my sheets. Hmm. I don't know. Um... Wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp. Something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy. <laughs> I'll find them. Thanks. But I am going to need a raise. <sighs> Don't hold your breath. I'd start by hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything that would lead you to them. Well, they're big into Red Eagle. <laughs> Great. See if you can find the path they took down from there. Maybe they looped back around towards the lake or something. I doubt they're where they were yesterday, but they obviously can't have gone far. Hmm, interesting. Ah. Uh. 
How the hell did they climb up there? That's more impressive. How the hell did the girls climb up there? These are some athletic women. Hmm. Where would this lead me? Can try and go up north, then south. Ups a daisy. No. Let's, let's get the supply drop. Really? Nothing? Nothing. Nothing for me. at a ravine what's this thing that spans across it that is how you get to my sector no kidding well let me hike over well it's locked up and mainly for emergencies i've never actually used it rangers use it from time to time but that's it hmm help oh god it's an emergency oh really yeah i got, I got um i got eyes on a tornado i gotta get out of here a tornado in the heart of the rockies Yes! Holy moly, I need to call this in! Tom, Two Forks sees a tornado! He says he needs an evac into my sector. It's a meteorological impossibility? There haven't been tornadoes in the greater Yellowstone region in a hundred million years? You're gonna need him to stay and take a detailed personal account even if it means giving his life? Okay, I'll tell him. Sorry, Hank. No dice. Man. DLC! DLC! Possible DLC! Possible DLC. Woohoo! Yeah, DLC. Possibly. Or a new game. Who knows?
Damn it, I don't have rope. Am I stuck here? Permanently? Let's hope not. Oh, wait. There's an abandoned pack out here. And it's not one of the teens? No, it looks like it was lost a long time ago. Well, you could always pilfer it for supplies. Probably. Well, I am flush with ropes now. That pack was full of them, in decent condition, too. That's lucky. I mean, there's there's enough rope here that I could just leave them hooked up, I think. Oh, get this. This uh, pack came with one of those cardboard single-use cameras. With pictures left? Yeah, he only used three or four. Neato. Thank you, Brian Goodwin. Wait, wait, who? The bag had the name Brian Goodwin sewn into the top. Huh. Wow. Do you know him? Yeah, I just haven't heard that name in a few years. What's... Ex-lover? Was he a fellow you had a thing with? Brian Goodwin was 12 years old, so, you know, our love could never really be understood. Haha, <laughs> funny girl. I'm kidding. Not about him being an actual 12-year-old. That part's true. He was stationed in Two Forks, your lookout, with his dad, Ned, three summers ago. Great kid. You can bring children out here? Mm, no. You know, I'm not a stickler for rules. They took off halfway through the summer. I see. Why exactly? I don't know. I never really hit it off with old Ned. And um, one day they were just gone. Sucks. Anyway, so it goes. Have uh, fun with that camera. Try not to snap anything that would scar a photodome employee. I don't know. I got a lot of hiking to do. Might get bored. Well, I'm bored as rocks. So I'll keep you company while you find those girls, huh? Do you see anything from yours, like, you know, with clues as to where they could be? <laughs> clues. I really like your enthusiasm for mystery. I'm just doing my job. I like it. I, I do. I just, I, I can't wait for you to give these girls a piece of your, our, mind, minds, collective. But no, no clues. I, I can't see anything from here. Huh. <laughs> Yeah, let's take a picture. But not these ones, no. Rappel, let's rappel. Rappel once more, come on. Where the fuck am I? Interesting. One, two, three. Four. Open sesame. Wow. Uh, someone found a fossil and put it in a cash box. Could be the same person who left that antler. And maybe they're leaving me an entire creature piece by piece. Interesting. Hmm.
A guy that talks to himself. 